So the next use case that I want to cover in this demonstration is logging on to Azure admin portal securely. So in order to do that, we are going to use two different methods of authentication using a FIDO based authenticator and a push based authentication in this case. Now, the reason we are doing this is because Azure admin portal is considered as a highly critical uh, application. So it has to be um, there has to be a higher assur assurance of authentication method in order to access the application. Now, in order to do that, let's quickly open Azure admin portal. And over here, I'm going to log in with the same username James at bigcorp.ml and click next. And you will notice that uh, my authentication request is being redirected to the IDP uh, in this case, which is Safenet Trusted Access. Now, all that I have to do is just enter my username and click login. So, when I click login, I'll be asked to enter my FIDO pin. So, I'm going to enter the FIDO pin and click next and then touch the FIDO token in order to log in. So unlike previously, I am being again redirected to authenticate for the second authentication method, which in this case, I am using a push-based authentication, or if there is an alternative method, I can use that as well. So first, I will try to uh, authenticate with a push-based authentication. And before that, I want to check if my phone is connected and uh, let me just quickly open my phone application over here. It's still showing a black screen, so just give me a couple of more minutes while it gets connected. Let me stop the mirroring and start it again. Okay, so the mirroring is started and let me open the Mobile Pass Plus, which is a software token installed on my iOS device. So what I'm going to do now is just send the push authentication and you will see that I have received the push notification over here from Azure and I'm going to approve this with a Pin. I can also use a touch ID uh, but over here I'm using a pin to log in so once the login request is approved as you can see in the screen I'm able to log into the Azure portal seamlessly without entering any passwords